Yo, what is up guys? Today we are making a review on my figures. <sighs> These are so hard to find. I just I just ran to Target so I could get some figures. So once a building hit kits, one they already finished, so I have two building kits now. Which I'm really happy about. So I'm gonna show you all my figures. So let me just do this and then damn. And then, so, here you go. You can't really see Piccolo that well, so I'll give you a closer look. I don't know what angle's good, but... So, yeah, that's all right now. Um, eventually, I'm going to get more. You already know. So, uh, yeah, um, it's a thing. So... I'm going to cut the video, and once I'm done, wait, no, 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 I'm not going to cut the video yet, I'm going to showcase all of the things that I just got, because it was my birthday party, I'm trying to make sure it doesn't fall, okay, so, first, let's go with Super Saiyan Goku, this I just got, so I'm going to need my, I'm going to need, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll be right back, I'm going to be speedy, I'm going to need my trusty dusty, Sound throw. Uh, what's it called? Okay, I'm not showcasing the Vegeta, like the uh, not the Super Saiyan one, but the base, like that one. I'm not showcasing that one because that's the one I still have to build. So, but I'll showcase the rest and. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, I'll showcase him when he uh is fully built. God damn it! Ouchie. Sorry about that. Uh, shit fell. Okay. 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 So, I'm gonna go get my uh, pocket knife, and I'll be right back. Yes, as you can tell, I'm in a different room. I'll uh, give you a look one day. But So we're going to look at this Goku. Come on, Gohan. Why'd you have to fall? So I'm just going to do that. Uh-oh. Looks like it didn't want me to slide it. Okay. So, I'm gonna have to place that more over there. And then balance it with the cell. And then, nothing fall. <sighs> ah, this is annoying. Okay. Damn. This sucks. Where'd my case go? There it is. So, I'm gonna put you in the case. case. Yeah, there we go. Case always in the box. So, this thing needs a bit more weight. It used to be so light. Wait, can I just set it here? Bruh! Okay, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so. Here we go. So let me just give you a quick look at the box. First part. Here's the side. Don't blame me. This is my first review. I know. You can flame me, but I wouldn't like that. That's mean. Okay. So here you go. Quick look. Yes, sir, it's my boy Goku. I used to only have a base one, so. 
Dang. Why is it so hard to get out? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. The head was the hardest part. I'll just show you that. Okay. There we go. Oh, it's like one of those clicky ones. Oh, it's not good. It's not that good. Okay, so here's his stance that he has put in. Uh, possible joints. It's only like this. Turn them. It's like a turnable joint. It's kind of hard though. Yeah. No, you have to. Yeah, it's only like a one-way direction thing. Uh, I mean, I guess good legs. It's just like the clicky joints. That good, a good leg, cause it. Okay, yeah, I guess. Eh, not really. This kind of goes out to the side. Okay. Say the arms are pretty good. So, I'll tell you what I recommend and what I don't. Dang, I almost had an. I almost had a Vegeta hairline. Okay. So, this isn't really as clicky. This will fall out. I don't know if that's meant to do that. This clicky joint. But it's not too hard to move, so that's a good part. This isn't as poseable. And comes with other hands, but if you find this at a store, I'll let you do whatever you want to do and do the fit, do the things. And I might be starting stop motions. And if you have, if you have experience, please give me some tips below, because uh, in the comments, I should say. Uh, so then, yeah, the hair is transparent. The face molding, pretty good. Uh, posing in general, it's good, but oh, uh, the waist looks ugly. Here, take a look. Uh, what is that? It's a good figure. If you like want to keep it in box or just like use it to be just to use it. It's a good figure if you want to just like have it for like a collection and everything. But if you're making stop motions, I wouldn't recommend it, but I'm a new creator to reviews, so don't always listen to me. Just don't listen to me. Listen to what other like other like good Viewers make say and everything. Okay, but the best way to keep them safe is by uh, keeping them in the box, which is what I do. Cause some I've already had for a while, and some I just got. So the Goku is new. That's why it looks so pristine. Okay, let's put the Goku over here. Let's do the ultimate Gohan. <sighs> Once again, it fell. Okay, it fell like so. Okay, so now we have the Gohan. Here you go. Here's a look at the box. Got Vegeta, Gohan, and Gamma 2 left oh and then it's the same thing and then there you go so now let's unbox it that's different now it's from the sides so there's my knife which is my trusty dusty knife and let's cut it open come on okay let's cut open and discharge cut open okay come on Get in, please, please. There you go. Now tear the tape. There you go. I'm a lazy man. That's why I'm using a knife. I hope people can relate. <laughs> so here's Ultimate Gohan in the cardboard. Not cardboard. Plastic. Uh. Don't you dare ruin the review, fly. Hey! Hey! 
Don't you dare ruin the review. If you do, slap you. If I can. Come on, Gohan. Uh, he's not broken. It's okay. I don't think he is. I think I broke it. No. Things are weak, though. They're still cool. <laughs> Me, why you? There we go. Yeah, it's not broken. That's what I thought. Okay. So, it's... It's movable. Yeah. Uh, clicky joints again. I think all Dragon Stars have clicky joints. I only have, like, three SH figure arts. One of them is really bad because they're off Amazon. Don't buy them off Amazon, please. Whatever you do, it's a waste of money because they're usually used. They come with the stand, but they're really horrible. Like, the figures are really horrible. Some come with a stand, not all. Okay, so, uh... It's a good figure. Like, it's it's... It has good clothes. It, it's it's good for detail. It's just the waist. Again, they gotta fix the waist. So, it's like the only problem I have. Uh, clicky joints again. It's hard to move the legs. Uh, jeez. Uh, okay. It's easy to move the foot, as usual. But the, the thing for the joint doesn't really move, so you can only, like, move it up and down. So, on the sad part, you can't, like, feel Eh, I don't know. Anyways, um, poses in general I think would be really good, but this, I wouldn't recommend it as well. Like, Dragon Stars is four and up, then again, so it's like for toddlers and everything. Like I said, if you want to you wanna see the hands, I'm not going to do the hands because I don't want to waste too much time or use too much time because I'm just trying to get this over with and do the video and because I just it, it is really hard being a contract reader to be honest oh. yeah <laughs> oh I took off the hand which is normal so it's really hard to get that on that's the only thing I hate about Dragon Star never mind just pop back on one Vegeta I have, the Super Saiyan Vegeta you saw, it's, it was dumb because, like, it, it just, like, stayed, and it was, like, it was, like, ah, 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 you're staying on, and then, uh, uh, I finally got off, no, I won't let him put on the other hand, no, okay, alright, okay, so I'm gonna put it back down, back in, in, and Gohan. Oh, incognito. I don't know if, what that means. But I heard my grandma use it, so it should be good. Should be, like, not like some, nothing bad, right? Right? <laughs> okay. I have two Super Saiyan Vegetas now, which is really good. The one is SH Figurates, which we will get to at, like, it's like the second to last, I think. Let's do the cell, since my thing's on the Gogeta and thing. And so, let's do the final form. Cell, and I'm going to keep saving this. I'm going to just say this for all. I'm not even going to say it for all. No, because you should understand that I'm not going to say the, uh, with the thing, like, that I'm not gonna put it on. So, overall, I already used it. Um, so when it comes in the package, you're gonna have this behind it with his little wings. Um, if you wanna, like, keep a figure safe, I highly recommend it. Like, keep it in your box. I don't know if I said that already. 
Sorry if I did. Um, but yeah. So it's really gonna be like all the other dragon stars. Let me just put you back in. Okay, it's really gonna be like all the other dragon stars. Clicky joints. This one's not as clicky. Hands are easy to take off, I think. But not really. Kind of. But uh, the detail is better. I'm gonna say it's better because here's the thing: it's not at the, see the waist. It's not so bad, and the wings are supposed to come off. See, these are these are the little wings, and you just pop them back on. There. It doesn't take that much force to pop them on. There you go, and there you go. You have your final form set. That's fully completed. So yeah. Really good. Um, okay, so that would be like that. So, I'm gonna put this back. Overall, just like all the other Dragon Stars, I wouldn't recommend it. But if you just wanted to have it or something, just want to complete the collection, why not? It's basically what I'm doing. So, I just, I like figures and I just want to use them. Especially since I'm gonna get used to stop motion. I don't know if you could do this. Hold on. I'm going to test. Let's do a test for you. Okay. So, no, I don't think you can. So, you got to take off the wings before you uh, put them put them back in. And then, well, it's whatever you want to do. It's like, like if you want, to, if you don't want to keep it in the box, you don't have to. You can just, um, you can just have it the way you want it. Like I'm not, I'm not telling you what you should do. I'm just giving you some, like I'm just giving you an idea of how you, sh like how she should like treat your things. Nah. Anyways, uh, what was the other one? Okay, there you go. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, 17 minutes already? This is gonna be a long review because I have a couple more. So, uh, let's just do it. Honestly, um, but. I'll just tell you the things of the, the Janemba and Gogeta. There you go. So I don't think you saw it. So here's it. Here's it up close. There you go. So I would say, sorry about that. I would say uh, it's mm, it's all right. I mean, like it's two characters in, against two. So two two characters in one pack. One little pack. Where did this hand come from? I think so. So keep your hands. Ah! Okay. Anyways, like I was saying, they're good, but like, wouldn't recommend it. Like always, Dragon Star. Uh, Dragon Stars aren't that good, but they're like good if you just want to keep them. Or because then again, they're four and up. It's like it's for four year olds and up. So kind of explains a lot. So, dang, what's at the bottom? Oh, it's the Nothing. But nothing's at the bottom. What? What? So I'm having technical difficulties right now. Just have to. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Okay. There you go. So now we put this back. So, we're done with the Janemba because I don't really want to pull them out again. So, we're going to move on to the Piccolo. I'm not going to do the Dookie UI go for one. It's not that good because if, if I even use it, it's, pro it's, on, it's probably going to go wrong. So, here's the Piccolo. Uh, I actually...
accidentally threw out the cardboard sh stuff. Um, so yeah. Um, posable joints. Really good. I, I really like it. Um, the knees and everything is really good. The, uh, toes and everything. The toes and ankle roll. Really good. And then the toes. It's really good. And then... Removable hands, they're really good. Here's the hands options. Uh, okay, so don't worry about the figure's head. Because you just have to... Uh oh, oh. So, I can't really show you the box. So I would have to, like, strap them in. So, uh, there it is. Special beam cannon hand. And then we're going to rebox it. Because, trust me, it, the figure's not hard to take out. It's really, like, not that secured in. But, yeah, so, I'm not re gonna record me building the little, uh, Vegeta, not little, but, like, you know, um, I'm not gonna record me building it, so, cause it, it's gonna take up a lot of time of my day, and I'm gonna sit here and talk to you, forget what I have to do, so I don't wanna do that, and, so here's the hands and everything, the faces, you just have to pop off his head, I had to, I had to explain that to my friends, when they were over, because it was my birthday party. That's how I got so much. Um, but yeah, so. Okay, there's a lot, okay. Now, time to put you back where you belong. Okay, so. Yeah, sorry, I'm not like reviewing everything, but I'm just reviewing what I want to review. Okay, this, another Dragon Star, not that good. Wouldn't recommend it. It's really bad, to be honest. Okay. One of my favorites. The model kits. I swear, they're so good. Um, I'm going to have to pull them. The only thing good about this, if you have, like, a spare Vegeta, besides this, comes with the Final Flash and this. And if you have, like, a Super Saiyan, any type, there's he has an aura back there. I'm going to pull it out for you. So you can see it. Oh yeah, here's the Goku. Here's the model kit Goku. So I don't really have much time, that's why I'm kind of rushing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This whole video is about me. Packing and repacking the uh, things. Please, don't don't hate me. Okay, so here you go. Here's this. Really good joints. It takes a while to build. It took me like an hour and forty-five minutes to build at least. And they're really. It's really good. The hands really good. This one's hand is really good, but. The only thing about it, so this one's like Kamehameha hand, like this hand, like the one he charges the Kamehameha with. Hold on, let me hold up my finger. This hand, it on this side, like this hand, it's kind of bad because whenever I put it on, it just like slips off. I think it's just like because uh, maybe something wrong happened with it. So. Yeah, but I still rec I recommend this one. It's a really good one. So the Piccolo, I also recommend, just in case if I didn't say that. So any model kit in SH Figure Arts things, I recommend. Because SH Figure Arts is a really good company With for uh, if you're looking for Dragon Ball. More like any anime. If you're looking for like any anime figures, SH Figure Arts got you. They're just really expensive because they're so high quality. So, I can't really review the Vegeta yet. I will cut the video, and then when I'm done with building him, I'll uh, uncut the video, and then I'll show you the finished result. So, yeah. And if it doesn't, if I don't show the finished result, well, that's just because... I may have, like, done something wrong with remodeling him. So, let's get to the final part. Like I said, this is part of the 
Dragon Star Vegeta. So, here we go. Okay, let's open this. Now, I don't think the, like, crossed arms will be hard to, like, get out, because it's just, you just have to pop these out. Jeez. Oh, wow, they struggle. Okay, so, it's not really, like, a, a you know, like, a pop them in. Like, that's meant to happen, because the cross arms, you have to, like, take out and then put them back in, because it's, like, a, its own hand thing. So, I'll do that um, when I get the base Vegeta set up. There you go. Yeah, you just have to have some pressure. Movable joints, once again, SH Figure Arts, really good. So, taking off the face, I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a do that. Let's see how taking off the face is. By the way, the hair is really spiky, so... Be careful and be prepared for a lot of pain. Um, actually, it's not that bad. It just looks like this on the inside. Um, I'll change the face. Why not? Okay. Damn. Okay. So, let's get that face out. And then, space in. Okay. Squeeze that in. Squeeze. Squeeze. Okay. Here's his new face. Cool. It's like a little smirk. Let me zoom in. Happy, happy, happy. Super happy that I got this stuff. If I didn't get a $130 Visa card, I'm not trying to bag. Like, I got two Visa cards. One was 30 one was 100 And since it was my birthday, um, I'm super glad I got this. So then I could... It was mostly just for this. It was mostly j just ran to Target found some stuff and well let's just say uh found this so but there's one tip for dragon ball figure hunting when you're looking for like figures you really want but maybe they're not there well they actually could be there you just have to look deep uh that's okay anyways you just have to like dig into the stuff so the foot, it's good. Yeah, it's posable, really good. The toe, really good. Um, articulation, good. Um, the ab joints, it's got the crunch, but it's really good. Yeah. Um, head, it's it's spinning. It's easy to spin. Sorry, there's so much light coming through. It's kind of hard to see it. But, uh, yeah, this, Vege this Vegeta, I recommend. It's a W. I'm not kidding. So, it was, uh, 35. Oh. Yeah. Uh, that's the only thing I'm going to record, so that doesn't really matter that they fell. So, that's the only thing I'm going to record now. So, now I'm going to go build it, and I'm going to go build the Vegeta. And I'll be right back and record. Bye. All right. All right, guys. I'm back from cutting. Um, so I'm done. It took me a couple hours, maybe two, because so I got distracted. But uh, here it is. Uh, it's really good. It took a, it took it takes a while to build, but I'd say it's definitely worth it. Because the posable joint's really good, I think. So far for me. Uh, oh, jeez. Uh, the foot is a little off. Uh, it, it, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, but it's just, it's just what it is. So, yeah. That's gonna end this, uh, review. Um, this is gonna end this review and everything, you know. So, yeah, uh. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, like and subscribe, and I'll see you later. Bye!